morning, uh, Excellencies, uh, dear colleagues. Uh, allow me to begin by thanking uh, the African Union uh, and the ambassadors of the uh, four countries for hosting today's gathering uh, on the eve of the high-level week of the General Assembly. Today's focus on the Sustainable Development Goals in the region uh, is timely. Collectively, we must deliver on our commitment to leave uh, no one behind, uh, as our uh, friend, uh, the Ambassador of uh, Cameroon, uh, said in his remarks. Leaving no one behind uh, will mean addressing one of the world's most overlooked humanitarian crises, uh, addressing the immediate needs of almost 20 million people uh, living in uh, the affected areas uh, of the uh, Lake Chad Basin, uh, and laying the foundations for peaceful, uh, inclusive, and sustainable development. Uh, Excellence, chers amis, uh, mon organisation, l'OCDE, travaille étroitement avec plusieurs pays et organismes régionaux uh, dans la région uh, depuis très longtemps. L'OCDE a l'honneur d'héberger depuis 1976 le secrétariat du Club du Sahel et de l'Afrique de l'Ouest. Ceci est le premier exemple d'un partenariat et d'une solidarité entre l'Afrique et l'OCDE. Il est né de la sécheresse extrême de 1973 et d'une volonté de la part des membres de, de, de l'OCDE et de son comité d'aide au développement, le CAD, d'appuyer nos partenaires dans la région. Et aujourd'hui, il compte parmi ses membres et ses parties prenantes vos pays vos, et, ainsi que vos institutions, notamment l'ECOWAS, l'UMOA, le CIDS, par exemple. Today, we continue to partner very closely with the uh, countries of the Lake Chad Basin, and this includes continuing to promote more and better uh, international development cooperation in support of sustainable development in the region. International cooperation remains absolutely crucial, but we all know that it is not uh, alone sufficient uh, if we're to address the root causes of the challenges faced uh, and many of the challenges uh, that the distinguished ambassadors have described uh, in their countries uh, this morning. His Excellency, the Ambassador of Nigeria, mentioned the Oslo and Berlin conferences at which uh, the OECD was privileged to uh, contribute to the discussions. Um, the, uh, and, and I think that the humanitarian crisis in the, in the Lake Chad Basin is, a, is an example of the nexus between uh, security challenges, food insecurity, and ultimately the foundations uh, for longer-term uh, sustainable development. Uh, food issues should not be overlooked by security issues in, in this whole debate. Uh, and indeed, I think food is, is probably uh, the key factor for long-term sustainable development growth. Why? Because the food uh, economy is the largest economic sector in uh, Sahel and, and West Africa. Uh, massive investments are needed in the food economy sector. Um, and it presents a large and unexploited uh, jobs potential, including for women and youth uh, in the region, uh, that will only continue to grow with the population growth, urbanization and uh, income growth. So the OECD, including through the support that we provide to the Club du Sahel and Afrique de l'Ouest, the Sahel and West Africa Club, will continue to play its role in, in partnering on analysis, on food and nutrition security, uh, on questions of resilience, on the question of transformation in our economies, uh, mapping women's trade networks, uh, gender inequality, uh, urban dynamics, the question of climate change, which uh, His Excellency the Ambassador of Niger highlighted uh, as a challenge which is uh, global in its cause and, of course, often very local uh, in its consequences. Uh, so I'll, I'll conclude, uh, Excellencies, uh, ladies and gentlemen, by congratulating uh, the leadership of the four missions uh, here in New York, uh, our friends and hosts uh, here at the African Union, uh, and by reaffirming the OECD's commitment and solidarity uh, with the uh, situation today in the Lake Chad Basin uh, our willingness to uh, continue to work uh, hand in hand uh, with partners uh, uh, as they address uh, these challenges. Uh, together, let us ensure that uh, we deliver on our shared commitment to leave no one behind. Thank you very much. Thank you.